everybody, it's Father Sean for another episode of The Couch Chat. So we're here in the dog days of summer, right? Smack dab in the middle of July. Always a great, great time of summer, a great time of vacation. And uh, actually today, July 10th, is uh, one of my brother's birthdays. So if you think of it, say a little prayer for my, for my younger brother. So always great to, to have the to love our families, right? What a gift family is. And actually it's kind of the topic of the, the couch chat is the next two weekends I'll actually be gone. So this upcoming weekend, I am chaperoning our high schoolers to the Steubenville Youth Conference and we go out in Missouri. We don't go to Steubenville, Ohio. There's various reasons for that, but it, it's always a good time out there in Missouri. So uh, appreciate your prayers, all right? Of all of us seemingly are hopeful that our youth meet Jesus Christ and live their Catholic faith for the entirety of their lives. And I know from talking to some of our teens who have gone to the Steubenville a Youth Conference, it's a, it's a life changing moment. It's one of those things that can really deepen our relationship with the Lord or it can call us from a life that we're not supposed to be living or it can uh, maybe clarify our vocation and where the Lord's calling us to go. So just ask for your prayers that all of our high schoolers that are going and also the chaperones who are accompanying them, that we may be filled with the Holy Spirit, we may be guided by the Lord in all that he asks of us. So, so pray for us. And then once we get back, or the day after we get back, I'm, I'm gonna go visit my family for a little bit down in Georgia, spend some, some summer time uh, with them. So get to see them, get to uh, catch up on family life. Of course, you probably know this, but I, my parents have moved to Georgia since uh, since I was a young boy, they moved like five years ago. So it's it's five years ago. And they live three doors down from my brother and his wife and kids. Not the one whose birthday it is today, the other brother. He's got a eight-year-old son and a six-year-old six year old daughter. And they're just an absolute to delight to be around. So look forward to seeing them and spending some time with the family. So I'll be gone two weekends in a row, one for the youth conference and one for the um, one for a little bit of vacation. So hopefully you get a, a little bit of downtime this summer. I know one of the exciting things that have happened this summer in our parishes is, is that uh, Father Steve Mondike has moved in to the rectory at St. Lawrence. And so many people have been instrumental in that happening. There's been a lot of generous support from not only people of our parishes, but people of the surrounding community, people that know Father Steve from Schoenstatt, those who know him from his parish. So we're just really blessed by the overwhelming support, the love, um, the generosity that people have shown uh, towards getting the house ready for him to move in. And just a reminder of one thing is that Father Steve is actually not assigned to our parishes. So he's not the St. Lawrence priest. He, he doesn't have any responsibility here and probably doesn't have a whole lot of time to do a whole lot of ministry. Remember, he still has a full-time assignment at uh, Sacred Heart in McCartyville, Holy Angels in Sydney, St. Michael in Fort Laramie, and uh, St. Peter and Paul in Newport. So he's got a lot going on. So we, I know, uh, and I only say that because uh, people have like called the office or they've made suggestions that, well, why don't we just have Father Steve Mondike do that? Or why don't we ask him to do this? Or can I call him to do that? And at this point, he's got a full time, a full load ahead of him. So um, yeah, so we'll uh, respect his, his time commitments to his current parish. You know, that's where he's assigned. That's where, uh, where he's paid through. That's where he's, he's got to uh, serve the people of God there. But we are blessed, you know, on his day off to celebrate Mass at St. Lawrence or, or any other little things he can do here and there. But most of the time, he's, he's, uh, his services are needed elsewhere. So we're blessed to have him. We're blessed by these uh, great months of summer. So. Hopefully you have a, uh, a blessed weekend and just ask that you would pray for, pray for safe travels for all the youth going to Steubenville, that the Lord may really touch a lot of people's lives and uh, that you'd pray for safe travels for me as well. So thanks so much. Take care. God bless. We will see you on the next edition of the Couch Chat. Bye.